Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to St. Mark's Methodist Church and Children's Moments with Miss Robin. Today, we are going to sing. I am so excited. It has been such a long time since you and I have sung together. We've hung together, maybe, but we haven't been singing. So today, I thought we would sing one of your all-time favorites, This Little Light of Mine. And I brought a prop to help us sing, okay? Here is my lamp. So let's get ready. Sing out loud. Sing it up so that God can hear us. Ready? This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to... Uh-oh. My light isn't shining. What's going on? A little while ago, I had this lamp turned on. <laughs> Thank you. You're right. Absolutely right, of course. It's not plugged in. This light cannot shine unless I plug it in. Hold on a minute. Let me try again. All right. Oh, plug in, plug in. There we go. That's better. Let's sing again. All right, ready? One, two, three. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Thank you, boys and girls. That was so much better. I love your beautiful, beautiful voices. You know, that just reminded me of a story from the Bible. It comes from John, the 15th chapter, verses 1 through 8. And it's a story that Jesus told to his disciples to help them understand why it is so important to stay connected to Jesus. In Jesus' story, he used a grapevine for his prop instead of a lamp like I did. And a vine is a plant that gets lots of branches on it. And a grapevine has grapes growing off the branches. It has a lot of fruit. Think about a branch that has been broken off a tree or vine, like this one. What happens to it when it gets broken up? That's right. When it breaks off, it just dies because it can't get any nutrition from the rest of the plant. And when it dies, it can't bear any fruit. Now it's not really good for anything except, well, maybe some kindling for a fire. Jesus said in John, verse 15, uh, chapter 15, verse 5. I am the vine, and you are the branches. If you remain in me, you will have much fruit. But apart from me, you can do nothing. Now, Jesus wants us to produce fruit. I don't think he's talking about apples or oranges, do you? No. No. He's talking about good fruits like kindness, generosity, faithfulness. And most of all, he wants us to love others as he has loved us. Do you know what? We can't do it all on our own. Just as a lamp has to be plugged in to shine, we have got to stay plugged into Jesus so that we can produce fruit. So that we can do the good things that Jesus wants us to do. Now, how do we stay connected to Jesus or plugged into Jesus? What kind of things can we do? Well, we can pray. We can read our Bible. We can come to church and Sunday school. 
and we can watch Children's Moments with Miss Robin. Boys and girls, let's bow our heads and say a little prayer. Dear God, help us to remember that we need to stay plugged into Jesus. If we are going to produce the kind of fruit you expect us to produce. We ask this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Boys and girls, I hope you have a wonderful Sunday. And I'll see you next Sunday for Children's Moments.